The ability to measure an object accurately is one of the most important skills that any student in an engineering field must acquire. This is known as linear measuring. The simplest method of linear measuring is performed using a tape measure or a ruler. More accurate measuring requires a vernier caliper or a micrometer. The standard measuring unit is the meter, and that is approximately the distance of one pace of an adult person. This straight edge is exactly one meter in length. Measurements smaller than one meter are expressed in either centimeters or even smaller in millimeters. A centimeter is exactly one hundredth of a meter. That is to say, there are one hundred centimeters in one meter. A centimeter can be divided into ten equal divisions. Each division is therefore one tenth of a centimeter. We call these divisions millimeters. To summarize, there are 100 centimeters in a meter, 10 millimeters in a centimeter, and therefore 1,000 millimeters in a meter. A good engineer's steel rule can be used to assess dimensions to an accuracy of one millimeter. Although you will see that most rules have been graduated down to show half millimeter divisions. As a practical exercise, it is suggested that you study an engineer's steel rule. Notice that the centimeter divisions are usually marked as 10, 20, 30, 40, and so on. There is a reason for this, which will be explained after the break.